Okay, this is the Pixel 6 Live wallpaper. This is how it is looking like. Looks damn cool, honestly. And if we double tap here, you can see this is how it is looking like. It's actually a wallpaper. It's not something else. It's actually a wallpaper. And you can also install this thing on a device by using just a module. And this module is just not for the wallpaper. It's for some other things or basically all the Pixel things which you can get on a device. For example, if you're using Arrow OS or any other custom which does not have Pixel props by default, you can use this module and how to customize this thing how to use this thing i will share with you everything in the description and in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end for example you can see this is how it is looking like this pokemon i think so looks damn cool for example you have the pixel launcher included if your device does not have the pixel launcher pre-installed you can get that by installing this model which is of course not a complicated process and yes i'm using it on android 12 here you can see version 12 i'm using it in android 12 which is working perfectly fine the next generation assistant is also in included in this version so this is also one of the positive positive things about this build this magic module called pixelify as always all credits goes to the developer and this is how it is looking like and including all the other things you have extra features in google photos app also and including that you can see you'll get unlimited google photos free storage for the full resolution photos and videos uploaded from your pixel device and something like that of course looks damn cool you have some pixel 6 magic is a feature also available in the google photos editing section and maybe some other options available here or there too we have the module available called pixelify this is the model which i was talking about and one thing keep in mind make sure you have the latest magic question stored called zygis so yes zygis should be enabled in settings you also got the google google dialers call recording option if your device does not support that you can use this thing too Okay, now let me show the installation process as quickly as possible. Magic version 24.3 is what I'm using and make sure you have enabled the Zygisk option. As you can see, I have enabled this option in settings. So make sure you also have enabled this option. Move on to the module section, click on install from storage and click this. Don't close this video yet. Make sure to check out the installation properly because it might give you some issues. So make sure to check it out. Then if you click on the installation thing, then you will see this kind of thing. So press a volume key. You can press volume up, down whatever whatever doesn't matter a lot and hence then you need these things android system intelligence of course i've installed this thing that's why it will not give me any kind of option but to install or ignore you need to press volume up for installation and press volume down to ignore this thing i have already installed and after one once of one time if you install this thing second time you can simply take the backup and you can simply install that thing as you can see this is how it is looking like i'm just pressing volume down to ignore these things and volume up to install those things so very simple things to install this thing including that there are tons of other things so this might be a very quite useful module for you so make sure to install this thing if you need something different something quite unique and all the pixel features for your device some interesting things i've already shared with you so if you like this video don't forget to like and share this link is in the description as always credits to the developer thanks for watching goodbye Over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air